whenever you bet, bet Fred. This is Andy Perua for Boxing Social. I'm delighted to be joined by Francesco Patera, who will be fighting Luis Ritson on Saturday. Francesco, how are you? I'm great, thanks. That's good to hear. You're going in with Luis Ritson, who has amassed a great fan base and has built himself up and built through the ranks very quickly, especially on these shores, and he's become a quick fan favourite. What do you know about Luis? Yeah, he's a good fighter. I saw him from a year ago, a couple of fights. I saw him fight and, you know, he's strong. He comes forward. You know, and that's what I know about him. I saw him fight a couple of times. Was you, was you surprised back then when you saw him, how quickly he's risen through the ranks? Yeah, he's, his career has gone really quick from, you know, and, uh, but yeah, it's good for him. Do you know anything about his style? Yeah, he's a come forward fighter. I think that's the only thing he can do. I don't think he can fight on the back foot. He only come forward, so that's we know he's going to do that. But we're ready for that. So, do you just anticipate it being Lewis coming forward and you trying to box, or will it be two guys in the middle of a ring just throwing as many punches as possible? No, I'm not going <laughs> to you know, fight in his favour. I'm going to do my game plan. But we know he's going to come. How, how do you think you'll deal with the atmosphere on Saturday night? You know, in Newcastle, they call the Geordies. You know, they're very popular with, for how they create noise. They're very noisy. You know, how do you feel you'll be able to deal with that? You know, I think I will handle it well. I've always fallen in the guy's backyard. And, you know, it will be different you know, this time. The fans are really loud. They're, they're supporting their guy, but... You know, it's okay, I'm still going to do what i got to do. Who do you think there's more pressure on you or Lewis? No, absolutely on Lewis. <laughs> absolutely on him. Why do you say that? He's got, you know, if he loses, he loses he very uh, a lot, you know. He got the whole uh, city behind him. You know, uh, Alan Shearer, you know, a legend, comes to watch him fight and that all. That. I think that plays in the set. He's a, you're, you're a big football fan as well, then? Yeah, I, I love watch football a lot, yeah. If you win, what type of opponents then, or what level do you see yourself progressing to? I know you've been European champion before. Are you just looking to stay at European level, or do you think you could push on to a world level? No, of course I want to fight for a world title. That's my objective in my career, to fight for a world title, hopefully win it. But, you know, if I win, I have a, you know, there is an oblig obligatory fight against uh, Marvin Petit. But we'll see what happens. Well, Francesco, thank you for speaking to Boxing Social. Thank you. Whenever you bet, bet Fred.